Tomo, it was a, a tight game, though, but no real um, blowouts there. I mean, there was there was chances, yeah. but uh, a couple of times you just didn't take them. Yeah, I did. I had some chances, and I had some really good chances. You know, I thought I walked up to that 104 in that last leg, and I just thought, you know, I'll have a go at that because I've been hitting it for the last, you know, couple of tournaments. I've been playing it pretty easy. And, um, yeah, I just, it went down on the four, and I thought, oh, well, you know, just try and set it up. I know like 60 in the hit. What did he hit? 76 or something. 76. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and you just can't afford to miss starts like that. Well, look, these, obviously the PDC boys, they, they've got that extra gear. I mean, this is their job after all. So uh, the odds are always going to be stacked against the, the qualifiers. But uh, you got some 180s, you've got some good scores, a uh, couple of decent finishes. But as I say, they just have that extra gear that they can slip into at times. Yeah, that's right. I had the, I had the eight and on the, um, 76 myself. And, I, you know, I, it came out of my hands so clean, I thought, oh, it's in. And I just went to walk, and I, you know, and I, anyway, I missed the next start, and I thought, you know, that was a good dart anyway, but anyway, I missed. Yeah, but you had a good smile to yourself when you, were, yeah, there yeah, we go. Yeah. I, I, I should have come back, I should have come up and, you know, re-approached it and, and stuff like that, but like I, like I said, the heat of the game, and I felt confident on hitting that, you know, like, they were coming out of my hands nice, they just weren't finding their targets, you know. No, but the uh, the experience, uh, it's when you look back on it, it's it's fun, is it not? Oh yeah, it's 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 a drug, you know, it really is. And this is only going to get better. This this sort of stuff for Australian darts, you know. I hope a lot of people learn from it. You know, I really do. Well, they, the guys have said themselves that they've seen the standard the last five years in Australia and New Zealand uh, rising all the time, and there's uh, a lot of. Uh, exciting new talent coming through as well as uh, the established names like yourself and, and Gigi and co. So um, the future is looking very, very bright for Oceanic Darts. Oh, absolutely. And you know what? I hope I'm around to see it. But, you know, like, I'm, I'm looking at the, the end of the spectrum now. You know, I've loved the game and it's done so much for me. You know, I've seen England and Japan and, you know, and a few other countries. And in the last two years, it's been really hectic, you know. But I loved every minute of it. But you're not going to hang your darts up just yet. You're going to have uh, another crack for this. Yeah, I'm going to have another crack. I'm, I'm, and I've got the um, the Asian Pacific Cup. I've got Winmore coming up, and you know I'm really looking forward to that. And I'm throwing some good darts, so hopefully I can go over there, take a couple of stepping stones, and then come back and be more prepared for this. You know. Well, we'll be looking forward to uh, seeing that again, Tomo, and uh, all the best for the future, buddy. Oh, cheers, mate. Thank you.